Right, so we start with the first of all, game quality. Uh, I love playing games, so the quality what I need is not working for the graphics. But I also love graphics, I love the beautiful graphics and then play some kind of the realistic uh, of the graphics. But if people just do for graphics, right, then to uh, try to get people attention and buying their game, right? but that is not a good strategy and not, in, not enough raise your, your game uh, by uh, visibility so I mean the quality like right, is about how do you make a gameplay like making so fun yes let's compare uh, two games one is a uh, overwatch and one is a uh, parody well you ask me to choose which game should I pick so I'd rather pick the parody not because parody is a uh, Game, and then everything is cheap, and then the character is like not really uh, impressive as over, Overwatch character. I know Overwatch is the quality is nice, and then nice detail, very appealing character, most iconic uh, character ever in the over, Overwatch, uh, Overwatch gameplay. But however, compare about gameplay, right? Overwatch is like I wouldn't say it's worth, but it's not fun as a regular game. I know I play a bit like Overwatch a big game, but now you know, it's just like going around and shoot everybody and then catching the points and then, and then just like that. But Paladin is like, not just like, not just like just swimming around and shoot your character I think. And then you also can like, customize your, how do you like, how do you increase your characters uh, attacking, defending, and then the skill? It's like you can like ever do. Uh, how do you figure out like how do you can control your own character? I mean, gameplay the most important is the uh, control quality. Because I play the game, the control is under me. I have to use my my mind, my my mind and attention to be in control all this. Uh, character to how to defeat the game but overwatch which means is like um yeah you they have the different variety different skill but overall is like it's just like just just fight and then fight again and again you can change the action the character uh, after you die and then you action again but it's like you don't know like so what we doing now we actually we keep swapping swapping the character so it's just like, just like, you know like CSGO, they, they kind of the thing. But CSGO is like, respawn after you die, and then you know what happened just now. Then you just go here. And in the parody is like, you want to access the character, but but you know like, what is your mistake? So just now, or before the, before the happen. So you respawn, and then you change the, the style, the skill, and then increase your uh, your barrage, uh, barrage and then against the other, other enemy. So this is why I play the enemy game. But the thing I don't like the Overwatch like, is it's the price. It doesn't mean say overpriced or, or the too much or over expensive the gameplay. You purchasing purchasing the game. The over the Overwatch is like you have to spend like maybe say uh, fifty minimum. And you know, maybe even for hundred, so depend what you sell. So when I, if I paying the game, if I purchase and paying the the game, then then it came out with the you know loot box. You know, right now everybody discuss about loot box is very very popular. It's because I don't like. I also the one don't like micro transaction because micro transaction is won't make fun for me because some say it's a like gamble, some say it's not, some say it's like you just spend the, the real money and then just get the digital type of the, of the skin but I feel like it's not really worth it for me to purchase the local situation but I mean like I spend like maybe like around 50 or 60 bucks to get the game at least I have uh, you know 
full character and I must have full character and at least have the gameplay of the level because the overworld they don't have the story mode or single play so this is what they make but I feel that the overpriced the feel is overpriced is like when I purchase the game you must give me everything you have not say not doesn't, doesn't mean like uh, I support you just like refunding you for your, for your gameplay but this is not what I play in my young I know it's different but this is not what I'm looking for but this is not not the worthy of what I play and then I know currently it also like you have to pay the robot but you can luckily it's, it's free but, they, but, but it's quite missing that we are not paying money to play the game and then not that like, just like everything is free so you have to pay something to get whatever you want so right now the gameplay is like they're using the money to purchase to purchase the, the game to increase your skill not say by your skill by your experience to, to, to against the gameplay so overall the i mean say the game quality right this mean uh i want control i want to play this game i want to control this entire game while i need not just say like rely on the system rely on the extra or rely on the thing to uh, to defeat all the game so this is what i'm looking for the game quality so we moving on on the second point of what kind of game looking for so uh the game i'm looking is uh i'm not looking for collection actually i'm looking for like very simple to say fun this work so sometimes i won't be say uh follow people say one game they looking looking for for playing then because i i would say that i'm not the I know like following people what they want or what they need so I choose my own so if a game like catch my interest then or catch my attention like maybe say uh, they got action game then more like uh, control my, my me so that's why I've been control control this character like go through the experience of the game the game the level of the game so right now like right, mm, Actually, you know like I have PS4 and I also have uh, Nintendo PS. So the reason I buy PS4 right is yeah, it, yeah, I just aiming for the Monster Hunter World. So Monster Hunter World is like the brand new and then the the new level and then the more and more improving of the game. So when I play this like this, it's much better than. Uh, what's the previous game before so it's more and more like convenient and then let's say don't need to be like go back to the the place and, and adjust it and then go back to the place and then place again so won't be doing any like you know double work of the time so the game i'm looking is like must have the you know uh, using the strategy to, to learning for this game I mean the game, actually I, I never like study in uh, any game game study or going through the game experience but I still it, I still it's game and play, I play whatever I, I want to see in the, the, fun, the fun thing then uh, if you like to see my collection I, then I try to make another episode about uh, my video, uh, no my my game collection, like any game collection. So in the collection like I won't be say it's the full collection. I only pick like whatever I, I want to play. If the game is not interesting for me then I might not buy my next game. But mostly I will choose the digital download for the whatever game they have. So yep this is like what I'm looking for the game. Alright so we moving for the next point of the the standard of gameplay. Hey, talk about this gameplay right? and I watch a lot like YouTuber, gaming YouTuber like they playing their uh, their own playstyle like how they play to actually 
anybody who watching their game uh, gaming channel. So actually I've been thinking like uh, how should I do for the gaming uh, for something entertainment. Maybe say do game review uh, for for the purpose of like to recommend people whether would you to buy this game or not. But that uh, that will depend like people is uh, try to maybe say sacrifice uh, their cash to prevent like to let people say or oh, do you want to try this game to purchase so the game so I mean the standard right is for the gameplay like is depend like like how the graphic would like is it the graphic uh, comfortable actually graphic like um, I think that graphic the, the most important thing about graphic is not just like nice looking, the nice detail and the nice uh, color. This is not the graphic we're talking about. This is the visual graphic. We all say graphic is about how the design uh, to affect the people see. It's like must know that where you're standing at, which one is your character, which one is your your enemy, and which one which position. Uh, you should standing then uh do you get the guideline do you get the do you get the the tip then how do you go without a guide that is what we're talking about in graphic i mean say graphic i mean sound like a bit uh the system but i mean the graphic is like let people to see it, uh easy and comfortable not like say uh looking so nice graphic then you can, then you've been spread by some of the view then you lose the focus for the gameplay so I mean the standard for the graphic right, is how do you make the player is uh, more easy to look in the graphic even the graphic app some of the game like some of the graphic have the low point but doesn't it mean it's like um, it's a very very bad quality I know some example like you know the 2D the Nintendo DS, like, I mean the 3DS, uh, most of the 3D is very, let's say, uh, not say polygon. In some of the aspect ratio is at the limited. So when you see it, it's very, the line and the volume is very off. So, but overall, you play it smooth. You play it like, not really say uh, uncomfortable or, or say over bright. Over bright for the the lighting quality so most important is like do you feel that the graphic is help you a lot or the graphic is make you feel uh, disturbing so this is like about think about the graphic it's very very important for that so from the old game from the old classic game to the modern game right um, most of the company is like really think that graphic is a, is a thing, is a everything but they all forgot about like how do you make the content look nice so talk about content or the game like well you must let like audience or any customer know that or the player feel that what kind of games I play do I play like uh, no playing do I play like racing? Do I play like shooting game? Um, you only talk about the model, right? We were moving on the... We were living on the last one. I mean the, the model, the model and the... And the game industry, how they do the developing. So we will catch on that. Now, uh, I mean the overall, the game standard, right? It's more important, like understand let people easy understanding how do I play this game. Not say like not doesn't mean like uh you put more graphics might be nicer. But more important is like uh let player easy to uh to get on to into the first step. Well so that's the that's what I thought. Alright uh, now we're moving the next step is uh, the game design. So um, talk about game design, right? just like what I said just now is as long as the game is 
fun, very fun and made me feel more experienced right? then I decided to buy so uh, I mean the game right more important is like uh, it made me like feel keep going and keep going of the of the level the space of the level so it made me think made me like how do I beat the game how do I how do I go through the game sometimes I will start the game then I will stop stop a while maybe I will I won't say uh, I won't play for a while then think and think again if I want to go back and play then go and play to beat the game actually it's a normal normal thing for any gamer so uh, when I design a game I, I won't say I won't hesitate and I won't random pick maybe say I will see people playing the review, as a review say the game is it worth it to pay when I purchase so you know like let's say talk about again Monster Hunter because I purchased around maybe I think it's 80 plus because I think retail price will be uh, 70 to 80 plus right now they, they drop to 65 um, it's according my region to sell the price amount of that so when I pay 80 it's like I wish that I play in worth it and some say the memory is too low I mean the low is mean the, the requirement graphics only have 15 15 to 16 MB and eh, no 16, 15 to 16 uh, gigabyte to install in your PS4 some people complain that is graphic is I mean the graph graphic is nice but why the memory is like too low but is it bother for for the gameplay no I know it's incredible like not really much uh, high graphic uh, high memory but doesn't mean like everything is bad everything is better when I pay like almost like 80, 80 plus a game then start to play the game and I said oh my god it's it's very fun and then a lot of things they do not just like hunting the monster and then collecting the material then you can do other stuff then they like they have the event like every every week so this is like I feel like it's quite worth it in if you play even they have the story mode I mean the story mode is like quite yeah open then this is why uh, this is why the game is won't be won't be say uh, take a lot of memory memory of the game for me so this is why I feel that okay this is worthy for the gameplay well I mean what it mean like when I spend 80 I must feel that I have to spend my money to get this thing like this thing is it worth it to me is it how many people to handle this thing and then how long they make this thing how long they make this thing and then I will get what I want from the digital type digital type rather than when I paying the maybe for DLC and some of the new box is not really it's not really like you know certified for for any game so that's why I feel, feel like you like being cheated like you're paying the paying the cash then to just purchase the uh, digital product feel like it's really wasting your money like then when you purchase the game so yeah when you decide like it depends like whether is it fun for you yeah
Right, we now we going to the end of the this topic. Well, I don't know how many people can understand from what I say because this is from what I what I think from my heart, and rather than I writing on the script to to talk about it. Well, um, if you got any like question or comment, like you can leave it on the below. So I will go through then see if. I think if your comment is make me sense and make me feel you want me to improve, right? I will do that. So I wish that my channel will be made, uh, make it interesting, make me feel feel like feel like hey, this is no bad channel. So telling everybody that if you like the video, you can click the subscribe button and the icon bell. Then leave the comment, but. I hear a lot of comments, but so far I didn't get any comment. So even some comment, any comment, bad comment, good comment, insult comment, sarcastic comment, just leave it. Just go ahead. Well, I want to see like how you react my my video. So thank you guys for listen this uh episode. So see you next time for for this channel. Thank you.